Have you been talking to Aaron Peel? Because let me tell you about Aaron Peel, right? Because listen to this, Trisha. No, no, just listen no, to Trisha, me for just a second. Tell the face because the hand ain't listening. Because Aaron Peel is like a total batty boy and he ain't got no pubes. And he's well out of order because he's been completely going around saying that I like smoke and drank when I was pregnant. But all I did was smoke like two packs of fags a day, drink like 50 pints of steak by tonight. But apart from that, I never done nothing. Hello, what's the crack? What's the story? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out some Little Britain. This is Vicky Pollard meets a dad. Mm. Looks like a Jerry Springer, Jeremy Carr kind of vibe. Let's go. Sure you want to go through with this? Yeah, I, I, I'm sure. Thank if you. you or your family have a sensitive yeah. problem, yeah. the best way to deal with it is to go on television and talk about it. Welcome back. Welcome back. Today we're looking for lost loved ones. Now, Ken, tell us your story. Well, um, 14 years ago, I had a daughter, um, but I've lost touch with her, and I, I, I'd really like to see her again. Now, do you know her name? Um, well, I didn't get the mother's name, but I think she called our daughter Victoria. What? Right, well, what we've got a bit of a surprise for you today. What you don't know is that we've managed to track your daughter down. Oh my God, I didn't believe it. <laughs> she's here today. Now, she doesn't know why she's here yet, but uh, please welcome Vicky Pollard. Now, you don't actually know why you're here today, do you? New, but, yeah, but, new, but, yeah, but. Is it because you're doing teens in trouble, right? Because I've never even done nothing or nothing, because let me tell you the whole thing, right? Because Michelle Bingham, who's a complete bitch anyway, has been completely going around saying that I went into Shelley Sackle's bag and nicked a bottle of Cinzano, but I never, but I did. But only because you're not actually supposed to have alcohol on school grounds, actually. And I was going to give it to Miss Turvey, but I forgot and drank it. And only got found out because I was getting off with Asif Shah behind the language lab and I was sick in his mouth. Uh, no, Vicky, that's not why you're here today. Oh my God, you've been talking to Destiny Platt, haven't you? Because you know Destiny Platt, right? No. Yeah, well, she ain't not even got nothing to do with it anyway, so just leave her out of it. God, stop getting involved, she's got I'll just touch a mixer. <laughs> no, I, I, I know why I'm here. It's because... Matt Lucas is so underrated. What a... J How do you even keep talking like that? Matt Lucas is a genius, man. Matt Lucas, obviously, and David Williams. What a genius. I'm guessing this is based on... Jeremy Carl, he got cancelled a few years ago. I think Jeremy Carl should have never been a thing. Should have never been a thing. All they did was just took advantage of people that were just, you know, people that were easy to take advantage of. You know what I mean? Because you see some people's lives, I'm like, why would you bring down to the telly? Why? Why? I just, the fact that he ran, the show ran for about, probably say 10 years, probably even more than that, I'd say. And you see some crazy stuff happening until one of the geezers finally, until one of the geezers, I was gonna say finally, until one of the geezers died, that's when they finally stopped the show. Which is crazy. I think some guy went on the show and then he himself after. Which is so sad. But yeah, crazy show. Why would you bring yourself to this show? Mad. Because you're doing I've had two babies and I'm only 12. You are well out of order because I was 13 when I had my second child. Anyway, have you been talking to Aaron Peel? Because let me tell you about Aaron Peel, right? Because listen to this, Trisha. No, no, just listen no, to Trisha, me for just a second. Tell the face because the hand ain't listening. Because Aaron Peel's like a total batty boy and he ain't got no pubes. And he's well out of order because he's been completely going around saying that I like smoke and drank when I was pregnant. But all I did was smoke like two packs of fags a day. Drink like 50 pints of steak by tonight. But apart from that, I've never done nothing. So you can well shout out Trisha Goddard, you total manger. Um, you're not in trouble. You're not in trouble. You're here for something nice, Vicky. Really? Yes. Tell me, really? <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. It's because you're doing I want to be a lap dancer and you want me on it because I'm like totally fit. And all the girls in the audience are going to be like well jealous because they're such ugly betches. And all the blokes are going to be like, yeah, go for it. And we want to see you up spearmint rhino because they want to do me because I'm so fit. But they've probably already got a stiffy anyway just looking at me in my leggings because they can all see my camel's hoof. Uh, no, Vicky. Oh, Ken, I believe there's something you wanted to say. Yeah, I want a DNA test. I'm going to be a lap dancer, everybody. <laughs> she spat. <laughs> the presenter, she spat. <laughs> Disgusting. She was like, Vicky, no, 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 no. Come on, Trisha, let's do a lesbian show. No, Vicky. Vicky, this is your dad. What? Ah, oh, oh, you're completely not a pervert. Oh, 
my god, what are you, some kind of paediatrician or something? Oh my god, that's disgusting! No, you got it wrong, because I came on the yeah, show... Well out of order! Uh, we're gonna go to a break. Yeah, we're gonna get beaten for this, Trisha Goddard! <laughs> Do you want to? Are you a pediatrician or something? What do you mean? <laughs> Your man, look at Steve Williams again. These are shows that we can always look back and say, "Wow, that actually happened." Absolute, absolute legends. When you look at Matt Lucas today, you'd never guess he did this. You'd never get. He's such a different man. He's, he's so quiet. I'm like, wow, wow, wow. Genius, absolute genius. To them too. If you guys want to see more uh, Vicky Polo stuff or Lil Brain stuff, comment down below. I'll try to react to it. They're probably going to be blocked on YouTube, so I'd have to put copyright on them. I'm so, so sorry. But you can watch this stuff without copyright on Patreon if you want to support the channel. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys very soon. Bye bye.